Rebecca Brand, and today we're going to make classic vanilla custard. This is a recipe I did when I was seven years old, and it's one of those recipes with very little ingredients you can make a really great dessert. This is my favorite recipe of all time. I learned to cook from this, and I'm going to show you how this is done. So all you need are three eggs, salt, sugar, nutmeg, vanilla, and milk. That's it. So crack your eggs in a bowl. One, two, three. Mix them up. We need to get our milk hot, so I'm going to put it in the microwave. And for two cups of milk, that's about four minutes in my microwave to get it hot. So it just comes to almost that boil. Also for this recipe, you're going to need really hot water. So I'm going to be having that getting hot while I'm mixing my custard together. That milk is nice and hot. Now in goes my water. That's going to take about eight minutes. Let's add a quarter cup sugar, a quarter teaspoon salt, a quarter teaspoon nutmeg, one teaspoon vanilla. Now stir that up. In it goes slowly, slowly. Don't cook those eggs. Perfect. Now, in my recipe book, it says to put it in these little custard cups and then stick it in the bath of water when you cook it. You know what? We never had these in our house growing up. I figured out you could just use a pie plate. You're good to go. So pour your custard into your container for baking, whatever that is. Oh, that color is so pretty. Okay, here comes my big pan. Now I'm gonna put my hot water in that. So my oven's on 350, it's preheating, and all this hot water goes in there now. In it goes. Okay, great. Now that's gonna go in the oven. You gotta be careful, you don't want it to spill. You sure don't want that water to get inside the custard. There we go. Okay, now that's gonna go in there for 40 minutes. If you do little custard cups, it's only gonna be 30 minutes. But this big pie plate is gonna take a little longer to cook. So let's why it's 40. So for the last 15 minutes, we're gonna make a caramel sauce. So I need to get half a cup of water really hot. In my microwave, that only takes one minute. Take one quarter cup of white sugar and put it into a heavy bottom pan. A small pan's fine, you're just making a little bit. And I'm gonna turn that down to like medium. So we're gonna stir it as it starts to melt. Okay, so when the color gets to be what you want, you're gonna add in your hot water. Be very careful, it's very hot. So make sure you stay away and just keep stirring until all the lumps are out. All right, all those lumps are dissolved, so I'm gonna keep that on low until my custard comes out of the oven. I think it's ready, let's check. Okay, the jiggle test. That looks good. Toothpick test. Bingo! Okay, careful, careful as you take this out of the oven. Don't get that hot water on you. Let's get him out. Shake, shake, shake. There we go. Here comes our beautiful homemade caramel sauce on the top of that. Ooh, how pretty is that? So I am so happy with this dessert. This brings me back to my childhood. Look at that. Wow. It is soft and gooey, and I could care less if it's in one of those little ramekins. I am happy to eat it like this. So what a great simple dessert. Let's try it. Mmm. It is velvety smooth. It's just 
beautiful. What a comfort dessert and so simple with such few ingredients. Subscribe to my channel and I'm going to teach you how to make all kinds of great stuff. So comment and tell me what you think of this. Bon appetit! <laughs>